What a mouth-watering prospect this is. Two genuine heavyweights of European football, both with the potential to go all the way. It's difficult to pick a winner here. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we have potentially pulsating live cup action to bring you. The first leg is just moments away now. It's Trabzonspor up against Ajax. Well, Derek, I think the instruction from both coaches will be simple. Don't take risks when playing out from the back. Defend well all over the pitch and don't concede early on. But it should be competitive. for the home side well it's a 4-3-3 with two out and out wingers but they do vary their movement they give width but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank their performances will be key today And the starting 11 for Ajax. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. And the game begins. Vitor Hugo. Here's Fernandez. Well, a long distance effort and a highly respectable one, Stuart. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. It's a decent effort, you have to say. Ryan Grafenberg. Well, Edin Vizca, a man who certainly knows how to dominate a game. Let's see if he can do it today. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him? At the moment, he's playing with great confidence. Every time he gets the ball, he looks like he's going to score, as his record in recent times will suggest. Three goals in the last three games. He's been brilliant. They do pass the ball with authority. But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Really bright-looking attack. And crossed in there. And it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Well kept out. It's a short corner. And played in. Well, still an issue here. And problem solved for now. Vizca. Opportunity to deliver the cross and crossed in the direction of the back post. Cross could be useful. He's got to clatter it away. Excellent defending. <laughs> Please, 
Regain possession. Has eyes for goal. Really good diving save. Elects to go short. Firing it towards goal. And just over the bar. Really good effort. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Well, here it is again. And how many times have we seen in recent games teams trying to play out from the back, not doing it particularly well, giving away sloppy possession and then finding the ball in the back of their net? So back underway, and the pressure has been applied. Ajax know it. Can they find a response here? Well, not the pass he had in mind. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Mohamed Kudus. Running with the ball confidently. And a chance to level it. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Now a short corner here. Delivering it into the box. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, nothing comes of it. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. On a poor touch, really, and unable to prevent the corner. Taken short. Happy to take on the shot. Fernandez. Vizca. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Klassen. Oh, wonderful bit of skill. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Flag raised for offside. Well, he decided to let the play flow, but now he's going to issue a yellow card. Yeah, I think that's good refereeing. He tried to play the advantage. And there it is, the half-time whistle. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Vizca. Could be dangerous. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Teammates in the middle. Well, in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. Vitor Hugo. And the story now confirms Spurs have got their man, Stuart. Yes, it's an exciting move for him, and hopefully we'll now see the best of him. But he'll need to settle in quickly to win over the fans. The move suits everybody, I think. The verdict is offside here. Klassen. Mohamed Kudus. Ajax ball 
it lost. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Now let's see about the cross. Just wanted to get it out of there. On and on he goes. And a decent delivery. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Favouring the short one. Well, thumped clear. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Well, as you can see from the stats, their general play has been excellent. They've dominated the play, they've created chances, but the finishing has been really poor. And that has to change at some point. Ajax pushing forward with options available. Lisandro Martinez. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. That's a useful cross. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Well, shortly we'll hear the final whistle. The home side with the lead. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point. And I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. And the cross has promise. Well, that cross was more than acceptable, but they couldn't fire at home. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Well, no booking comes from it, but he's going to have to tread carefully here. Well, I think that's great refereeing. He doesn't want to be throwing cards about willy-nilly. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. And deep into the penalty area. Over the touchline for a throw-in. He's in control of the situation. Great strong tackle. Throw-in forthcoming. Here it is now. A substitution. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left. And the margin, just one. Now Jimenez. Well, sloppy in possession. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their... Oh, big chance! And still danger here. Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Klassen. Well, possibilities in the centre. But defensive efficiency there. Well, this might be the final opportunity to draw level. Trying to pick out a teammate. And there it is, the referee blows for full time. And my goodness, no wonder these home fans are ecstatic. Still, there is a job to do, but they must fancy their chances based on this performance. Yeah, they just about edged it for me. But if the first 90 minutes is anything to go by, this tie is far from over. Really looking forward to round two now, Derek. Well, Edin Vizca carried out his duties apparently with ease. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled.